Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this master lock trailer coupler lock in the gray finish, and it can be key to like. Now this is a gray coated die cast zinc trailer coupler lock, and it'll lock onto your trailer coupler and guard against trailer tow away theft. This one here you can see has a nice gray zinc finish to it that'll resist rust and corrosion. And it is designed to fit most 1 and 7 8 inch, 2 inch, and 2 and 5 16 inch ball diameters. And they'll fit the following coupler brands. They'll fit on the Reese, the Fulton, the Atwood, the Putnam, Marvel, Ideal, Acme, and the Dutton Lanson. Basically, your coupler just needs to have a flat lip on it, no larger than 5 8 of an inch wide. And just to show you what we're talking about, I happen to pull a uh, coupler right here. You can see this fits onto a 2 inch ball. And you can see it's the trigger latch design. And when I mentioned the flat lip, if you notice this flat lip that goes around the front here, as long as that's no longer than 5 8 of an inch, it'll work on this lock. But you do need that flat lip for the lock to work. And just to show you how that works, it's pretty easy to install and remove. Basically, this locking mechanism, will first go over that. If you look right here on the locking mechanism, if you see real close, there's actually three positions it offers. There's one dot over here, one at the very top, and then one right here. Basically, what that is, the position one, which is the one furthest right over here, this will allow you to freely move the shackle. You just hold the key in there and you can move the shackle back and forth. Once you let it go, it's spring-loaded. I guess I can show you that. We'll go ahead and put the key in there. And you can see if I turn it all the way over to one, you can slide your shackle back and forth. Now, once you let the key go, it'll spring-load back into the position number two. And what position number two does is it'll let you ratchet the shackle toward the ball coupler. So you can see just like that. And then you turn it, bring it out. And once it goes back into two, you can ratchet it toward the coupler. And then position three, which is way over here, if you just turn it to that position, you remove your key, that keeps it in the lock position. So now what I want to do is demonstrate it on the ball coupler. So we're going to take it all the way out this way. And then you'll take your open the latch, put it over there, push it down, go ahead and latch it into place. And now you're latched on and your lock is on there. But then the thing you want to do now is to lock it into place, you just, you're just you in the position number two. So you can push it all the way, turn it to three, pull your key out, and now it's locked. It's not going anywhere. So if somebody, this is stay attached to your trailer, so if somebody wants to try to hook up to your trailer and they open the latch just like that, even though it's unlocked, you can see it's not going to let anybody get into there and hook up and take it away. So either locked or unlocked, it's still going to have the coupler lock on it. And then to remove it again, it's in the three position. Turn it all the way over to the one, slide it out, let it go. And then you can remove it just like that from the coupler lock. So as we mentioned, it's very easy to install and remove. Two keys are included. And the other feature on this, this lock can be keyed alike if you're ordering more than one lock. You just go up on the top of our product page on the right hand side and you'll see a box that'll say keyed unique or keyed alike. If you want them keyed alike, just go ahead and select that. <clears throat> but that should do it for the review on this master lock, trailer coupler lock in the gray finish.